Hello everyone, it's Karen for Makeup and Beauty Blog and Tabs, doing his diva thing and cleaning. Um, and we are broadcasting live for another episode of Sundays with Tabs from my back deck. Um, it's under spring construction right now. Sorry about the mess. There's kind of like plants all over the place. And some of them are questionably alive. They're from last summer. They're hanging on though. Yay for Mother Nature. Um, and today we'll be talking about Oh, hello. Oh, hi. You're showing everybody that you like to scratch. Thanks very much. Anyways, today we'll be talking about this cat enclosure, um, otherwise known as Tabs's Command Center, a.k.a. the Thug Mansion. Uh, I've been getting a lot of questions about this, or Tabs has been getting a lot of questions about this, and what? It, it's actually a homemade kind of thing. El Hub and I made this. Um, we went to Home Depot, and picked up about like $40, $50 in material, just some lumber, planks, some remnant carpet, and uh, chicken wire, this little latch thing for his um, in and out gate. And we put this all together in, I don't know, it was a couple days. Um, well, actually, <laughs> El Hub did most of the heavy lifting. He used two by twos for the outside frame. It's about six feet tall and, um, and four feet wide and about two feet deep. And then we put the planks together. We drilled in the planks. Um, I was the one who put this remnant carpet on the planks um, using a just a crafts glue gun and a staple gun. And then we put in the latch gate thing so that he can get in and out easily. Um, and then El Hub put the chicken wire. And basically what this does is it allows Tabs to sort of spend time outside without really having to be outside. Uh, when we first got him, well, not first got him, when he first decided that we were his humans. Hi, buddy. Hi. Um, hello, say hi. Can you say hi to your aunts? You're so funny. You're such a monkey. Look at you. Um, he was an outdoor kitty. And when we moved up to Novato, he was mostly indoors with like outdoor walks on his leash. And we just wanted him to be able to spend time outside on the deck safely without us having to be there with him um, the whole time. So we just keep our uh, sliding door window open, um, the screen door open. So we let him out here and he hangs out for a while. And sometimes it's like a couple hours. Like he was out here last night for like two, three hours, just hanging out, swatting moths, just chilling, watching stuff on the hill and patrolling and eating, of course, because that's what he does best. And when he wants to come inside, he just meows and we hear him and we open this little latch up just like this. Of course, it's just like that, swings open, and then it comes out, um, and we let him back inside. It's, I think he really, really enjoys it. He, this gives him the feeling of being outside and lets us feel safe about having him be out here on the deck, and we don't have to worry about him, like, jumping on the rails because he's tried that before, the little crafty devil, um, and we just don't trust him on the rails, so he's not that agile type of cat, so... Anyways, um, yeah, it was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be to make, and it came together very quickly. So if you're handy with power tools or perhaps know somebody, you could easily do this for your own feline friend. Anyway, um, thank you again for watching, and thank you for spending your Sundays with Tabs, and we'll see you again soon. Bye. Monkey. Hi, monkey. Come here, monkey. Buddy. Come here. Yeah. You're showing mom who's boss. Buddy. Come here, monkey.
No shame. Absolutely none. <laughs>